Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at an awesome new redesigned diesel pusher from Newmar. This is a 2022 Newmar Vantana model 3717. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first and the inside features then. We're gonna give you three things we love about this new mower and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's the world's only channel giving you that true and biased review about every RV that we review. And again today, I am super excited to be taking a look at this beautiful Newmar Vantana. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey, Andrea. Hi, everybody. How's it going? It's going good. I just want you guys to know how dedicated we are to you. Yes. We are out here in Look Tampa. at you. <laughs> Look at you in your little outfit with the pink, with the pink. In, in the thunder. <laughs> yes, what, where are we at today? We are here at RV1 in Tampa. Yes, 813-659-0008. If you're interested in any Newmar, make sure you guys give them a call. Also, Andrea, RV1 represents Newmar at the Hershey Show. So, Great. you know, everybody who's looking at Hershey, RV1's going to be there. So make sure you mention that yes. you saw them on Matt's RV yes, Reviews. Yes, thank you so much to RV1. And Andrea. Yes. I already recorded the outside. Oh. So, so I'm going to do the outside right now in point of view mode, and then you and I will do the inside together. You ready? Oh, okay. Model is 3709. The actual tip to tip length is 37 feet 10 inches. This is the Numar Vantana. This sits on a custom Freightliner chassis with 360 horsepower Cummins engine. Very nice. Right underneath there is a Onan 8000 diesel generator. And right up there, you can also see that it does have the camera up top for the 360 digital view. Coming on down the side here, look at these tires, Andrea, they're the Michelin's. 305-70R 22.5 with the shiny Newmar rims. What's real nice right here, we do have our keyless entry with a doorbell, very nice. A door awning right there, frameless windows, and uh, oh, new for 2022, the Vantana has the Gerard awnings. Coming on down the side here, we do got dual fill up on both sides. Check out the oops, check out the storage here. We got power and USB right there. Sorry about the shaky camera, guys. I'm trying to. Uh, Hang on, let me set the umbrella down for just a second while I show you guys the storage. More storage there. Look at that slide out tray. Now this is an XCR chassis from Freightliner, which means it's a raised rail. Very, very nice. Centralized vacuum there. Okay, nice aluminum slam latch doors. This one tilts up. Oh, that's a TV for the outside. I love that. TV with sound system. Very nice. Mm -mm -mm. It's a little hard to do this in the rain, but we make it work for you guys. <sighs> right here. A little bit more storage. And then here is your batteries and everything. Here's your batteries and everything. Perfect. Let me climb over this. Coming around the back, we do have a 10,000 pound hitch. This motorhome can tow 12,000 pounds. Ladder to get up on the roof. Backup camera there and everything. Also, you have your Numar 360 camera. So you have your 360 camera and your driving camera. Perfect. Finishing up with the driver's side. Let me set this down again. All right. A little bit more storage there. Right here, 50 amp power cord with a real surge guard protector. Okay. Right over here is where you fill up your DEF. Right over here is your water hookup. Uh, you got your 
um, water hose on a reel, black and gray tank dumps, outdoor shower, water filter station. And then check this out. You have your emergency exit right there. On a coach at this level, that is very, very unique and nice to have. Right here, you can see that it does have the Oasis Chinook hydronic heating system. Also, we'll put all the specs about this motorhome right here. Bing! For everybody to see who's watching on TV. Right here, you have your interstate batteries and the other side of that slide out tray. Well, Andrea, the outside of the Vantana looks great, but the inside looks even better. Let's go take a look. Perfect. Wasn't that a nice surprise? Wow, that really was. Let's check out the inside. <laughs> That's so nice of you, Matt. I know, I know. Oh. Don't forget the cargo carrying capacity. All right, get on inside, Andrea. Don't mess up your hair. Oh, my hair's already messed up. Cargo carry capacity, 5,561 pounds. Oh, this is pretty. Oh. Okay. Let me get the lights turned on. Yes. Can you still? I'm gonna give them the 360 view. Okay, here we go, guys. Look at this. As you can wow. see, beautiful. It's beautiful. Slides are out. Yeah, guys. It's, it's raining. It's thundering. Um, look, this is really pretty. Going through here, we have the bathroom. It's got that interesting door. And the bedroom here. Very nice. And Andrea. Before we begin, we do want to take a quick second to thank the sponsor, CampgroundViews.com. You guys saw them in the intro with all our other sponsors. Because of our sponsors, we're able to be 100% independent now, y'all. And we're able to bring you true and unbiased RV reviews. Big shout out to CampgroundViews.com. They do 360 digital tours of campgrounds. I have a video with the owner of CampgroundViews.com. Watch that video right here. Also down in the description below. Um, it's just a great product if you're an RVer. Make sure you guys check them out if you don't know who they are. Also, we have a promotion code in the description below for campgroundviews.com. Yes, you guys, check it out. It really is a one-stop shop. Yes. Andrea, let's get started up front in the captain's chair. Look at this. Oh, hell yeah. They left the key on for us. We got the levelers right here. Very nice, look at this. The digital Freightliner dash, I love that. This is going to be an adjustable steering wheel. Okay. You mean the telescoping kind? Uh, yep, here it is. Well, yep, up, down, in, and out. Very nice. I'd be driving like this, cruising. You got your side cameras, your navigation, everything's right here. Nice little tray there. And a little bucket thing there. And then Andre, you wanna sit my co captain seat? Of course. Okay. Oh, yes. How's that feel? This is the life. It sure is. Electric power seats yep. there. Yeah, it has a footrest, so when you do swivel, you can recline back. Sure does. Um, it also has one of these. What the heck? Look at this. I like that. Man, now you could be wow. sitting on your iPad or your yes. laptop. Yes. Driving down the Very road. Very nice. And, oh, okay. And then, guys, we have the step cover here. Okay so nobody needs to worry about falling down yep yep for sure got a nice cup holder here we've got the daytime shade and the privacy shade yes look at that <laughs> so nice i like that a lot and uh we got some cabinets up here matt let's show them interesting huh okay yep i, I like, like that i like the color i don't see this color a lot yeah no so it's I nice do like it. it's nice no bunk over the cab though Okay. It's okay, it's a diesel pusher, you know? And then over here in the living room, Andrea, the double sofas, okay? So, um, if you guys didn't see my NASCAR weekend, I actually stayed with my buddy John, who has a Newmar Dutch Star. And he has these foot things, and he says they're a catch-22. They're the biggest pain in the butt when the slide-outs are in. But when the slide-outs are out, he said they're a godsend, um, you can fill them with storage, their foot rest, their, very, their end tables. Oh, open that up, let's see. Yeah. So it's a little ottoman. 
with storage. See? Yep. That's great. Yep. And it's really nice and, you know, you have a hard side and a soft side. Okay. So you can kick your feet up there. Um, I just want to touch on the slides. Look at the um, design on it. Very Look. detailed. Yes. Cabinets. Very nice. And then this is nice. It has the felt on the inside to help prevent the rolling. Nice. Yes. Can we get that light sconce on over there? Maybe. Uh, dinette, seating, wall. There should be a button right underneath it, probably, or around it. Nope. Usually there is. Can't help you here, Craig. <laughs> well. Oh, I found it. Oh, very nice. That's a bright light, too. Sure I like is. that. And then right here, this is, okay, this is the pull-out air mattress. Okay. And let me tell you guys something. I slept on one of those over the weekend. <laughs> it did its job. I got to sleep. I was a, a non-paying customer, so I slept. I'm not going to go on a one-week or two-week camping trip with them. You know what I'm saying? And then across is another sofa, and then here's what's really nice. You push this button. And we got a televator there. Oh, look at that. Oh, you, you don't have gotta, to hold it. You just got to push it one time. Oh, that's nice. I do TV see a sound up. bar up there, everyone. So nice. Got more cabinets. Yes. Look at the nice hardware and everything that they use along with it. Okay. So nice. Then we got this one over here. Very nice. Now check that out. I like that window back there too. That was nice. Samsung TV. And again, very nice. This one does jackknife down, but the real winner here is the Ottomans. How it's a foot rest, cup holder or whatever. Really, really nice. Nice tile floors, beautiful. And then right here, it looks like they went with the table and chairs option. Does extend. So they have two more chairs. Power right there. Looks like this maybe, not this side. Looks like maybe this might do the whole, yeah, this does the little office situation there. Okay. I'm not a huge fan of that because it's a very tight office. Storage underneath there and everything. Nice windows, how do you like the valances? Um, you know, they're okay. Okay. And and look at that. Art Deco. <laughs> no. Oh, okay. Well, Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's, it's now time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. And we got it right here, Andrea. Okay, so just so everybody knows, base price is $340,641, base. With all the options, it's $63,697 in options. Um, and what that does, man, that hydronic heating system is $14,000. Wow. Uh, that's really expensive. Or no, yeah, maybe more or less. Making it a grand total of the MSRP of $404,338. Okay. But Andrea, do you see that sticker right up there? Don't show it, don't show oh, it. Oh. But did you see it? I did. It was not in the 400,000s. RV1 has a fantastic sale price. That's the reason why they're chosen to sell Newmars during the Hershey RV show. So if you're interested in this Newmar or any Newmar, make sure you give them a call at 813-659-0008. The people at the Tampa store will be still in Tampa during the Hershey show, but they can get you that Hershey show price during the Hershey show. So give them a call and they're going to take fantastic care of you guys. And uh, Andre, let's continue yes, the video. Yes, make sure you, you tell them that you did see it on Matt's RV reviews. Burr, 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 burr. Thanks, y'all. Okay, here's the kitchen, everyone. Look at this. Oh my goodness. So nice. Adjustable shelves. Gonna show this one here. Okay. Electrical outlet back there. That's yes. nice. Yes. Okay, we've got a nice window back here with the MCD shade. Look how big that window yeah, is. Yeah, that is a big That's window. That's the whole side. I love that. Um, we got lights under here too, and more electrical outlets. That's nice. I mean, there's two right here. You can never have enough outlets. And look at all this counter space. I have not oh, seen it all. My goodness. That is amazing. Okay, so let's see here. We got a double sink. Mm-hmm. And oh, that's heavy, huh? Yeah, nice extension there. Let's see, okay, under here we got for sponges. Yes, ma'am. Oh, 
Hey, you got a trash can. That's a hundred four dollar trash can. <laughs> it might be more. And we got more drawers over here. Okay. Very nice. I I like the handles. Really is. Newmar it's does really a fantastic cute. job with their interior decor. We World missed. Pool. We missed this. I didn't miss that. Oh, did you get this? Yes. I'm so sorry, Andrea. I will never question you again. <laughs> We got a convection microwave here, Whirlpool. Okay, okay. I like how the fan there is covered. And we've got the probably two burner induction. Yes, induction. Top. Very nice, I like the backsplash here. Andrea, wait, you know what's even nicer about that? What? You can take that induction cooktop outside. Oh, nice. It's pretty sweet. This is cute, I like that. Nice backsplash. Okay, we got another drawer here. Okay. Oh, and you got a dishwasher. Fisher Pacal, very nice. Am I, oh, there we go. So nice. Okay. And, okay, so we got a Whirlpool residential with the ice maker and yes, water filter. Very nice, got a good size freezer here. Mm -hmm. And then, oh, look at this. Look at this pantry. Oh my goodness, wow. Oh, kind of got to push it in. Yep. It's locked. But wow, look at that. Look how much space there is there. That's yep. incredible. And then you have another uh, storage up there. Yes, ma'am. And then here as well. That is fantastic. Fantabulous. All right. Let's check out this bathroom. Uh-oh. We got the strange door. Oh, I hate this door. <laughs> I hate that door. <laughs> oh, I like that there's a mirror in there, though. That's okay. nice. Yeah, so... Over here in the shower, pretty nice shower, okay? I'm not gonna lie, it's a nice shower. Oh, uh, really nice, I like the way it looks. Good space, good size. I actually, again, guys, over the weekend I did shower in a shower about this size and, and it got the job done and it was pretty nice and efficient. Very efficient, especially with the, um, the hot water system. Oh, okay, here we got a nice, look at that, that yep. goes back, that's pretty good space for linens. All right, and so we have the medicine cabinet here. Mm -hmm. That's great. I love their sink. Very, very cute. Yeah. I like that they continued this backsplash. And we've got cabinets under here. Very nice. And then we got the magic door there. I love the magic door. <laughs> the magic door. The magic emergency door. And let's check out that toilet. I do like, I really like that they gave you a mirror here. Now time for the toilet test. Andrea, this is porcelain, this is nice. This is a prime pooping position. Bing! Very nice. I'm actually really surprised, Matt, because I think this bathroom is kind of small. So I'm, I'm actually I, I'm actually surprised that it got the four piece. Look at me, I'm great. I, I know, but it doesn't it seem small to you? Nah. Oh, uh, maybe, yeah. It's not like a big master bathroom in the rear. All right, here we go, walking into the master, and we got a nice pocket door there. Got a king-size bed. Yes. Got yes. nice cabinets up there for storage. Nice TV right there. Window, and then down there you got uh, six drawers. Very big, very nice. We got the small ones down there. Very nice. Look at this. I like how I'm just going to show this light up here. Oh, yeah. That's beautiful. very detailed. And then this is a stackable washer and dryer. I love that. Got to have one of those. Right. Here is the closet wardrobe. Oh, that's a good size. Yeah. Nice closet. You have a safe back there for nice. all your monies. Got a light up there. All your monies. Okay. Oh, look at that. Interesting headboard, you guys. Look at that. I it's like, like it. kind of mirrored. I like it. It's it's a good looking rig. Storage nice right up there. Storage up there. I do like that they have um, nightstands. Yeah. And they have an electrical outlet there. And then they have another little cabinet down here. Now, I wonder if there's storage under the bed. Let's check it out. Oh. There sure is, with two extra chairs. Nice. So nice. And then look at that little additional support for the bed. Yeah. Very smart. Well, Andrea, 
that's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's now time we give you three things we love about this new Mar and three things we don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Three things we dislike about it. Okay, I might have all three if you don't have one. I have one, but you go first. Okay, first is outside. That lower TV out there. No, no, no. Oh my God, look at Andrea's face. Andrea, don't worry, we're not going outside. I'm gonna <laughs> tell people about it. First is outside. There is the TV in that lower storage. I don't like that, here's why. When we're watching the NASCAR race, uh, I want the TV in the slide out. I wanna look at it. I don't wanna look down at it, if that makes sense. Oh yeah, definitely. Just in a bad position, in my opinion. Okay. That is number one. Andrea, number two. Okay, um, Matt. I didn't get to see this, so what I don't like is I don't like the sink here. Why is that? Um, I don't know. I just, I don't, I prefer, That's how you're able to get the awesome kitchen. Yeah, I just don't like the sink there. I prefer here. it to be um, over here. Okay. And then maybe have this as counter space. Well, here's what I will say. Um, okay, yeah, no, I agree. What I will, I will kind of combo. With the double sofas, with the ottomans, and with this, it does make it a really tight walkway when the slide outs are yeah. closed. So that's exactly. number two. And then Andrea, number three. Number three? I'm going to kind of agree with Andrea now. <laughs> I am gonna say this is kind of a small bathroom since it's the only one. But more importantly, I hate this door. This door is so stupid. I hate these doors. Um, I think a pocket door would have been fine on that. My buddy Travis, what's up Travis? Uh, he has an Essex, which is very expensive. And they have these types of doors. I just don't like the doors. I don't get it. I'm not a part of that life. <laughs> it's, so, not, it's not your jam? It's not my jam. Okay. Okay, that's a new shirt. It's not my jam. Okay, so that's three things we don't like about this motorhome. Now it's time for three things we love about it. Andrea, you ready for me to go first? Sure. This is a relatively smaller diesel. I love the double sofas and I love these ottomans. I think it's fantastic and great and I love that feature about it. Very home-like and I like it. Yes. That is number one. Andrea, okay. number two? Number two. I do love Newmar's attention to detail. What do you mean? Uh, I All their touches. I love their, their light sconces. I love their lights up here. I love the design here in the slide. Just really nice touches, even their handles. It's just something I don't get to see a lot. So yeah. um, you'd have to see it, you guys, to appreciate it. I love it. I love it. That's number two. And then Andrea, number three. What was good enough to be the like? I'm going to be, I'm going to be, I'm going I'm to I'm be good enough to be. Here's what I'm going to say. Here's what I'm going to say. I'm going with it. I love the residential... I'm, I'm saying the kitchen. Andrea didn't like the kitchen setup. I like it. I love how much countertop space you get, okay? I love how you're able to get a residential fridge and you're able to get pantry space and a stackable washer dryer in the back. Again, guys, for a diesel motorhome, this is small. So the fact that they were able to contain it all in that area is super awesome and nice. I agree. Well, Andrea, that's it. That's the review. Thank you guys, absolutely everybody, so much for watching. If you guys have any questions about this new Mar, please call RV1 of Tampa, Florida. Phone number is 813-659-0008. Um, again, they are going to be at the Hershey RV Show. So if you talk to the salesman at the Hershey RV Show, if you're looking to buy any new Mar, and you tell them you're a fan of Matt's RV Reviews, we're going to work something out with them to make sure that you're getting a fantastic deal uh, because that's awesome. And Andrea, is there anything you want to say? Yes. Hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Uh, Numar will be reading the comments. Yes. So uh, we appreciate everybody's feedback. Um, I hope to see you guys at the Hershey RV Show. Yes. Um, September 15th through the 19th. Yep. And um, thank you so much to RV1 for letting us be here. And? Um, and campgroundviews.com. Yes, campgroundviews.com and all our sponsors. We have links to all our sponsors down in the description below. We couldn't be 100% independent right. without we them. We appreciate all of you. And thank you so much, guys. I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.